Some that you want to want. No, okay. I'll go with the team. What do we say? I think we're going like a sweeter, sweeter wine. wine. I'm out. I wanted the sour wine. I'm a dry wine. guy. I'm a dry guy. We is that what, dry would be sour? Dry is not sweet. So sour. Sour is not on the radar. He's what he said. Hmm, he's, he's wrong. Like, he's an expert. <laughs> <laughs> you want to get I worked at the Tasting Panel magazine, a wine and spirits magazine. How long did you last? <laughs> I was two and a half months. Wow. You worked there? Before I left. After I, I, think, I think I played satisfactorily longer than you were. <laughs> well, I'm sure you didn't get fired. Well, I did get fired, but I left after that. How did you get fired? I put a man's name for a woman who was a high donor in a image on the website. Oh, shit. It was supposed to be like Julia left and I wrote Paul left and she was quite offended and she was <laughs> half the magazine's funding. So she, they fired you for that? She called and had me get fired, yeah. Actually, really? Yeah. That seems a little... That's power you can't buy. <laughs> fired. Chris, Chris is turned on by the story, just so you just know. Just to be clear, Whoa. with a magazine, you can buy power with about a thousand pounds a month. Yeah. <laughs> it's not exactly... Like you can buy this power? It's not exactly... Yeah, it's, it's like, <laughs> not tell, from tell a me, Jedi. Tell me more about this power. Not from a Jedi. <laughs> How can I get Ludwig fired? <laughs> I'd love to get Ludwig fired from his own company. How would that make it to publishing? I had no oversight. <laughs> <laughs> How did you pass the interview? Uh, I lied. Spell cat. See? No, no, no. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, you fucking asshole. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 I was a journalist. Arrange these numbers, which one's bigger and which one's smaller. <laughs> Boy, I think wine's better than spirits. <laughs> you, give him, you give him an inch and he's like running a fucking mile. And get on. No, I, I had a journalism degree. When I, when I applied for the job. <laughs> Where's his laughing? I did. I did. At the Daily Bugle. Where the fuck are you looking? <laughs> this wasn't years, a real magazine. I went to, four years, I went to the Harvard of the Southwest. The oh, Harvard okay. of the Southwest. The Harvard of the Southwest. The Harvard of the XYZ coordinates. <laughs> oh, I went to the hardest. The hardest. The hardest. The hardest. Wow, that's a problem. Share that with the viewers. <laughs> Oh, that smells amazing. Oh, wow, that does smell good. That's wasabi, too, right? Do you want to yeah. have a. Pole? Yeah, I'll have Paul show you that. I think you can eat yours, don't worry. What's the sauce? The What's the fish? What's the fish? <laughs> <laughs> you weren't listening. Oh, I thought you were Jersey. You're Jersey. You're Hong Kong Jersey, mate. Yeah. I'm not translating for you. What's the sauce? What's the fish? Oh, I, I would be embarrassed to translate for you. Pero, pero, Oh, wow. Wow, wow. wow. I, will, I will feel It inferior. takes a lot for Chris to say that. I'm going to wait for my parent. Wow. The quadruple wow. If he went to Arizona State, that's a joke school, someone says. I didn't. I went to the Harvard of the Southwest. Which is? Arizona State. Okay. Do you know they have the most students of any college no, in the world? Because they let anyone in, apparently. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> my God. This is so good. You're, this is amazing. Okay, well, I'm, 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 I want to try. I want to show the camera. Mine, yeah. You're good. All right, Paul. Oh, that's like grape juice. Come on. It's actually not too sweet. So how many students do they have? 70,000. No. Oh my goodness. It's like a small island nation. Mm -hmm. Well, it's okay. Only like 30,000 graduate. Really? The graduation percentage is 45. Mm. Oh, I've, what I've been the there. Fuck? Why? Because everyone drops out. Oh my god. Because they realize where they went. Did you drop out? No, I got two degrees. Wow. Out. Let's try this. It's very nice. I graduated with an honorific. I was, I was quite the student. Well, wow. That's fantastic. Hmm. <sighs> I cheated it. Not a big wine guy, but this Me? is good. I have trouble hey, finding we, the flavor. We've made fun of each other on this trip. End of the day? End of the day, I cheated it. I cheated it. My G. Have a good week. Of the flavor profile yeah, of this, left. I'm so, uh, can you Can you tell us the vintage from the year? Oh, nice. It's a 2023. Wow. I can already see it's 2020 on the bottle. It's 20. <clears throat> and it's a petals with mm. fragrance. Mm. I have no taste for wine. I've like, done, oh, this is my job for a while. Can, can you describe have, it in clever Yeah, blocks? I actually cannot. That's it's about, so uh, hard for me to. This wine is fine. Some sort of rhyme. It, they're too complex. I want an incredible description. Like never before. I mean, honestly, it's muted. It's like... 
Is, is, that, is, is, is that it? Is that it? Yeah. For the I, man I, who's worked at a magazine for six I would, weeks. I would drop eight. Did, did the magazine go under? Uh, yes. After he left. Almost assuredly. No, I think it probably had a recovery. What was that magazine? <laughs> Tasting Panel Magazine. Tasting, Tasting Panel, Panel magazine. magazine. It was just dedicated to wine and spirits, and they had like two sommeliers on staff that I worked closely with. They would just drink wine all day. What was their names? Just the first name. Uh, Sebastian? No, it was women, actually. What, you wanted to be a woman's name? Rewind a bit. Remember you got fired? Yeah, I do. How do you feel about that? How'd I feel? You're like, I'm going to start my own like wine magazine. I was fucking thrown off. They, they called me into the office. They're like, hey, can you change the uh, passwords to all the accounts? And I said, sure. And they're like, and by the way, skip your lunch today. Come to the office. I was like, yeah, why not? And then I went down, <laughs> and then the, the, like, the president, who I'd never seen, was there with like the HR manager. They're like, yeah, we're going to let you go. Did you get a severance? No. Why not? Because I don't know, they didn't. Oh, that's way. crazy! You should have huh? severance. How old were you? Twenty-three. Well, you, you like, should have oh, severance. Oh, okay. I, yeah, I was literally like, oh. oh uh, Do you think I'm gonna set up a rival? If you can't join the beat them. I thought, fuck! I bought an apartment and a car. I can't afford any of it. <laughs> or, sorry, rent an apartment. Where were you? You moved to LA for this? I moved next to the place too. I lived oh in Encino because it was there. I would genuinely love to see Ludwig who has to manage like an actual like. Money, shit. a real job. No, like, like you, like there is a possibility that you wouldn't be able to like figure shit out. I mean, uh, this is the time of my life where I bet my last hundred dollars. You, I would love to have watched like that. Bet you bet your last hundred dollars? Yeah. On gambling? That's such yeah. a Donald Trump story. Why would you do that? And Donald Trump never well, he's had like, hundred dollars He tells to his, what, his daughter, he's like, you see that homeless man over there? He's richer than I am because I'm in debt by five hundred million. But, I'm so sorry, you had a hundred dollars left mm -hmm. and you were like, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna let this one ride. It was Did like, you win? it was like I, w I was working at Best Buy part time and I didn't have a paycheck hit. Mm. And then so it was like, but it was like early in the month. And so I had a hundred in the account right. and I did a bet against Slime. Okay. I'm the Greek yeah, Jesus. Yeah, and, and we did a hundred dollars on a random Mario Party minigame and I lost. <laughs> And then I said double or nothing. Oh no. And guess what game it was? That stupid domination, the mashing game. Oh. And I won, because that's the only game I'd practiced. So the only way you got out of poverty was by robbing your friend. <laughs> well, what's well, or, or, origin to, story? To be fair, it was double or nothing, so he didn't actually pay me out. I mean I just didn't lose my last hundred. Yeah, that's right, true. Right, right. He, I've told him since. He said it was badass. He's cool Hashtag inspiration. I gotta check the bag. Alright, we're gonna Is this, is this okay? Something. There's something's not right. Yeah, that's right, I'm gonna check the bag real quick. You you're, gonna also, what are you, uh, you're gonna check the back? There you go. The back. Oh, yes. I thought you were gonna like go back to... there. I, I, I wanna see what's going on. Like, yeah, like <laughs> pop your head in, like, how are we no, doing? No, that's fine, but the battery is. Uh, <sighs> all the modems. I think he's dead. I can't believe they fired you over that. Yeah. It's very petty. Well, you know, to be fair, the job you know oh, okay, was misleading. <laughs> so they wanted <laughs> a. Because I, I was a journalist, but what they actually wanted was, was a web developer. Check. No, I wasn't no, really writing stories as much as I was uploading the stories onto their website. And their website was like HTML, and I didn't oh, know that. God. I never learned. So I was like learning on the fly. Mm. And the reason they were hiring someone is because the 70 year, 70 year old guy who was doing it was the only one who knew how. Like nobody oh, else on right. the staff knew except for this guy. So I, I did like two weeks of training, then he was like, I'm leaving. No, and I was like, okay. Oh my God. Yeah. So what were the Somalia's names? Just their first names. I think it was like Sasha or Sarah. Oh. Okay, okay. Uh, they're uptight. Well, they're sommeliers. Yeah, they're they're uptight. Uptight. I think that obsession with wine is like, you gotta be a little psycho. But My weird. sister got pretty close. To sommelier, it's very tough. It's extremely hard. It's and not. It took her like a decade. Yeah, it's quite competitive. She's really, really skilled at wine, at least, without being a small. And I think you can only test one time a year. Yeah, she failed. Yeah. But she did well. And if you fail, you have to wait a whole year. Mm -hmm. Why is that? I think it's just so you can't, like, spam it and bink it. You know, like, uh, you can't just get lucky after. Like an LSAT. Yeah. It should be good. Like, I'll take it again. Yeah, it's and, uh, similar to an LSAT. Mm -hmm. She good. knows her good. wines. But I, I, the only thing I learned from that is, like, tannic. Like, the tinnicity of wine. It's like when it like gives that mouth feel where it feels like your mouth is dry, mm. and I find that I really like that. And this is not tannic at all. This is I like oil. Like so well, um, then you love this because this I, is I like yeah. Thank you. And white wines aren't really tannic anyway. No. Yeah. Skip it to be. I, I was in McDonald's. I, think I was pretty okay at my job. Like I wasn't good. I wasn't bad. I didn't do anything. I just did my job and I didn't talk to anyone. Um, and, and, did they yeah. think you were weird? I even just thought I was mute. I did not talk to anyone at all. You didn't I, I did connect not with them. Talk. No, I didn't want to fucking connect with you anyone. You didn't see I their ways. Burgers and go home. Mm. 
Um, you weren't really into the company culture. What was your favorite thing to cook and prepare at McDonald's? <laughs> You're never gonna finish the story. Nugget. <laughs> chicken nuggets. Chicken nuggets. Anyway, so I, you know, I quite like chicken nuggets. I, I, anyway, so this, okay. Good I, for a snack. Did you make a sausage egg, egg muffin? <laughs> I did. They're and good, it, aren't they? No, so what you do is the egg came in a, in like a, a ketchup squeezy thing, and you'd squeeze the egg into the circle thing. What, what the fuck is the squeezy thing connected the to? Egg, the egg was the in chicken. the squeeze, like a ketchup what, squeezer. What, what are you, uh, Yeah, what, that's what the egg is. What was the hardest thing to make? It's not a real egg. The hardest thing Surely it isn't the muffin one. Guess. No, it's not. No, it's definitely Why do you life. think it's so like a cake? Wait, wait, no, to be clear, they use a circle mold. It's in a yeah. circle mold. There were times we had this like squeezy thing that they would just fucking you, do. You, I've seen them make, I, look, I watch, some, a, I, some franchises. I watch a lot of McDonald's cooking videos. <laughs> they have a circle mold, you work they crack an egg. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I literally, I literally worked count. there and they so weren't cracking eggs. All right, carry on. People yeah. like, stop you interrupting. And both I want this story to go on forever, it's so exciting. Okay, let me finish my course so that I don't feel bad about holding this place up. This is amazing, by the way. It's very, very good. Damn, you down that egg. Mm -hmm. You know they use a squeeze bottle for that. <laughs> yeah, you think so? Probably. Why is it consistent? <laughs> I feel like, why are you acting like I didn't work there? Like, I saw it. I squeezed the egg in myself. Maybe it's just Wales. Maybe they have I mean, lower maybe, food standards in Wales. Maybe no, they don't. It might just be like Wick Donald's or something, like some knockoff Welsh version. Hey, carry on. <laughs> you... So anyway, I work at this job and it's just awful. Everything about this job sucks. And like, the, the, the beginning of this is that one time, we we're allowed to have water during our shift. Like, oh, what a blessing. Yeah, I know, right? Wow. Like cattle. But we're all, oh, you know the sake, you know the, you know the sake cups we just drank out of? Yeah. yeah. Those are the cups we're allowed to use. They were literally like tasting like tiny little shot glasses. Oh my God. Water. This is tragic. And they were like, you can't have the bigger cups because that wastes money. The paper cups, bigger cups. Oh, so you'd have to go to the fill-up machine? So you'd fill it up a bunch, you'd fill it up a bunch, and they'd be like, don't you think you've had enough water? And I was like, I'm, it's, just, it's, it's all of a twist. It's like 35 degrees in summer and I'm yeah. standing in front of a deep fat fryer all day. Can I have more, more water? And one time I dared, I, I flew too close to the sun. There was a, there was a, a J2, <laughs> like a, uh, an Oasis promotional drink. It was like a, a, another drink that was like mm. kind of expensive. And I, I like, what happened? Uh, for a uh, second uh, and they like reprimanded me for it. They were like, you cannot have Oasis. Oh, look right there, CCTV would have yeah, They were like, you, you can only have water. Wait, how did they catch you? I guess because maybe someone knocked on me or something, I don't know. So it, someone somebody grasped you up. Somebody grasped me up. So set up. They well, grasped you up. I think someone grasped Judas, me. Judas of McDonald's. And I was like, what the fuck? I think this is because you didn't make good relationships with other people. Probably, yeah, yeah probably. They, they wouldn't have, they wouldn't have grasped down. you out if you had good friends. I thought it was prison. I thought I had to keep my head down and just fucking walk. Mm. Anyway, so that was like, she reprimanded me. I didn't understand why. And I was talking back like, I can't have fucking Oasis. Why can't I have Oasis? <laughs> you were saying that. No, I, I was like... He mumbled it. I, yeah, I was, I was like... I can't I was like, I was like, I was like, why, I, I was like, why can't I have Oasis? I just think I should work it. You know, she was like, speak up. She did say that to be fair. She said speak she up. She did say speak, speak up. up. boy. She it's like Miss Trunchable. <laughs> she, 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 oh, she, she, genuinely, she... But the weird part was is that she treated all the girls really nice and all the men like horribly. Well, maybe the women were just good at their jobs. Uh, well, they never had to work in the kitchen. So... That was kind of an thing. Progressive. No, okay. I think everyone should work everywhere. So only, <laughs> only, the, only the women were working at the farm. That was weird. What's up with that? Um, my joke. Well, no, look, no, well, no, 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 no. keep the ragged men out back, surely. Yeah. yeah. Don't yeah. want to serve car. I don't want you Plus, serving me while we're going. Friendly, you're not good for front of staff. I would have been very friendly. They, they, they never gave me the chance. Well, you're like, oh, the nuggets. Well, don't now take Pete's word for it. Pete said tampons were one of the worst inventions. Yeah, he did say that. Technically, so, no, I didn't. So anyway, anyway, the, the way I, I've been applying for other jobs, and I put McDonald's down in my reference, and the one day, this is the one day I left, I quit. Well, I've been working there for about just under a year. A year? You did this for a year? Yeah, I did for a year. Holy shit. How like, long after the Oasis incident did you quit? Like four months. Mm. Oh my oh, god, it's a while. But I mean, in this time, I'd done a number of other things that were wrong. I, I was pouring in the milkshake mix and it spilled all over me. Oh. Because it comes in a sack. That's kind of. Just a sack. <laughs> That's what they call <laughs> it. They all went, way when I spilled it. Oh, like when you drop a pint in Dude, the... it's literally the milkshake mix comes in a sack. That's super It's the worst way. vessel for ever pouring. <laughs> yeah. And it's like up here. Yeah. So you know, wait. You, so anyway, I, I, you're five foot two at that point. I, I was like five foot one yeah. at most. So anyway, this is going on. And uh, I, I, I've been applying for other jobs. And I want, really want to be a lifeguard. And I finally got a lifeguard job after maybe like eight interviews. I'm not kidding. I went to so many interviews. And every time when I'm leaving the interview, a, like a jacked adult male would walk through the door. I was like, I'm going to get the job. Because I'm, I'm like pimple. I would really like the job, please. Yeah. And there's, there's no shock. So anyway, finally got a job. And then... I didn't know, because I thought this was a made-up thing. I didn't think they actually called your references. 
Oh shit, they don't normally. Yeah, they call It's yeah. quite rare. So they called up McDonald's and they were like, hey. So the next shift I go into work, they're like, hey. That's we got a, bit. We got a call from the sports center. Uh, said you, uh, they wanted to ask about you. They said, are you thinking about getting a job there? Uh, what's up with that? Icarus. And then I told them, this is what I, I, I said this, and this is what like made her fucking flip. I was like, well, I don't see myself being in McDonald's forever. And she went like, what? You think that McDonald's, people can't work in McDonald's forever? I was like, no, I don't think so. Well, why didn't you just say, I do, but not me? No, I said no. <laughs> I, said, I just, I, at, the, at, the, at the time, I thought, I thought McDonald's was like, oh you go there God. and then you leave. Right. You do yeah, your time. That's a fair assumption. You do your time and you get back. I think I people gonna, have that idea. I was, was going to go to university. I think, honestly, back then, too, it was probably more like that. I think yeah, there was a transitional to me, job. To sure. me, I wasn't thinking about it, like, it being rude. It's changed in the years as well. Right. I said it I said it just as, like, because that's genuinely what I felt as, like, a 17-year-old kid. I just oh, thought, that's very I saw McDonald's as a stepping stone, so I said that, and I got chewed out in front of the customers, and then, like, I started, like, tearing up. I was like, I'm not going to take this. I quit. And then I, I, I quit on the spot. Oh my god! Because I was like, I was like, I was like starting to tear up. And I was like, oh, fuck this! I'm not doing this. Because I, I didn't, I didn't understand like why it was wrong at the time, but I knew it like it didn't feel right. <laughs> you know what I mean? Because you're yeah, a kid, yeah, and you're like, course, I don't understand why this person's shooting me out of it. Sounds a bit abusive. I definitely was not right. I was like starting to fucking. I mean, cry. if you're that young, you, sh you shouldn't be talking shit like that. Yeah. Do you go back? Do you go back to my doors and just look at people? And the I, I, went, I went. I went back. I'm like, Dog VA now. <laughs> Matt Trump works there. I went back like two years ago, and he was like, "Oh, I'm a big YouTuber, huh?" Was, That's the person that made you cry. No, that was another guy. Like, go. Uh, yeah, they were yeah. gone. They were gone. But that's crazy. So I search them up and find them. And then I, I got the, even though they, the reference or shenanigans happened, I was worried I wouldn't get the job. I got the job. My mom was pissed that I quit there. She was like, you, why would you quit? You still have two months until you start the next job. And I was like, ah, oh, they were being mean to me. She didn't believe me. Oh, really? Because my, my mom always thinks that, like, you were the she, wrong. <laughs> well, she knows I was kind of a menace. So she. she <laughs> She's never, you know, it was always well, like... you know, when you drink the Oasis, that was a menace move. That was a menace move. We're a monster. Have any of you guys been waiters? Yeah. No. Never. Oh, yeah, you, no, you were at the Elon Musk. Prince Andrew. Oh, he was, a, he was right. at Epstein I, Island. I served Elon Musk, didn't I? Epstein Island, didn't I? Don't say Elon, didn't I. I served Elon Musk and Prince Andrew. Didn't I? I served Elon Musk, <laughs> didn't I? 